do you need a credit card do you want to see what your limit is before you get that hard pull do you want to know if you'll even be approved for the card here are six cards that show you exactly that the first one is the deserve digital this card is completely digital you will not get a physical card you can get up to 1.5 percent cash back zero annual fee it's a soft pull they'll let you know what you'll get approved for before you accept it if you accept it then that turns into a hard pull up next is the GM rewards card. So if you have a business, you should get the business card instead of the personal one. So you do earn points, but it's only on like GM products and stuff like that. So if you plan on getting a GM card anytime soon, then this one is cool. Now, another thing, it has the 0% APR for the first 12 months. So it's a good card if you need to do a balance transfer or if you need to make a large purchase. Also, you can do the Apple card hack to this one. So you should not get a hard pull, but you have to do it specifically how it's done. The next one is the popular FNBO card. The bad thing about this card is you have to live in certain locations. So they cut it off for the worldwide. So yeah, that's the only thing that sucks about this card. But soft pull lets you know how much you'll get before you pull the trigger. Now this one, this is a good one. I've heard of people getting like anywhere from 12 to 25K. So read and see which one of these cards are gonna be beneficial to you. Cause one is like 1.5% 1, 1. cash back. And I think the other one is like 1% cash back. So it's like, why would you pick one? You know, read through and see which one is the best, but it's a good card. If you can't get into Navy, this is a good alternative. Okay, now this card, this is my first time hearing about this card, but you can get up to $50,000. So <laughs> you might want to check this out. Get pre-qualified, 2X points and gas and groceries. So if that's what you spend a lot of your money on, this might be a card for you. Here is the X1 card. Honestly, this card went viral a couple of years ago. I honestly think they just paid a bunch of people. I got to hurry up because... I can't turn my ear on so y'all can hear me. <laughs> anyway, I really think they paid a bunch of people to promote this card, but it's a virtual card as well. You like you can add virtual cards. Um has decent rewards. Look through it, see if this card would be beneficial for you. All right, next is the Apple card. I absolutely love this card and it's metal, so I love pulling it out. They have something new where they have like a savings account. Also with this card, do the Apple card hack. Don't get a hard inquiry if you don't need to. Also, it did take me about three times to get approved for this card. And last is the Dover Federal Credit Union card. If you decide to apply for any of these cards, remember it is a soft pull to check, but I would advise you to have at least 